Good day. I'm going to start my report. The paper ID is 20DEC15, and the title of the paper is The Effect of the Job Environment of County Managers on Job Satisfaction. The content includes five parts. First, introduction. Second, theoretical background. Third, research design. Fourth, empirical analysis. Fifth, conclusion. The first part, introduction. This change, which companies are paying more attention to after the implementation of the 52-hour work week, is to ensure the quality of work life so that employees can work more efficiently in work-life balance. It has been studied by many scholars and that various characteristics of work environment affect office workers' satisfaction and work productivity. In many studies, a policy proposal for improving the job environment within the company was made through the study on the job satisfaction of accounting personnel. These results were closely related to the job satisfaction of accounting staff. However, the job environment of Korean companies is in a poor environment in terms of institution, finance, opportunities for promotion, autonomy, and job sharing especially the accounting staff, who is the subject of this study, has a high turnover rate due to the poor job environment and low satisfaction. Therefore, this study aims to investigate and analyze the effects of the general environment and the job environment on job satisfaction of accounting personnel in order to find out whether the job environment recognized by accounting personnel is significantly explained to the job satisfaction of employees. Based on the results of the empirical analysis, this study hopes that the improvement of the job environment of accounting personnel will be utilized as basic data for creating a stable work stable work environment and improving job satisfaction through it. Also, based on the results of the study, the limitations of the study and future research directions are to be suggested. Second part, theoretical background. First, concept and factors of the job environment. As many studies prove that employees' efficiency and productivity are improved and the satisfaction and loyalty of employees to the company increased with environment improved. The job environment is considered important in terms of corporate management. The job environment refers to the overall physical and psychological environment that is designed to enable the organizational members to perform their duties smoothly. In addition, the work environment is a concept that includes interaction with scholars organizational culture, policy, and physical environment, which affects the work that the staff has perceived as his or her job from an institution, organization, or individual. The job environment is defined in various ways as subjective and policy must concepts according to the research purpose and interest of researchers. The achievement and performance of an organization is determined by what kind of work the organization members are in charge of in their workplace and what they think about their job. This also contributes to members' competitiveness in the organization and even the organization itself. Therefore, competitiveness in an organization leads to satisfaction and performance from the work of members. This is determined by the job environment or a comprehensive concept that encompasses support from the organization and good relationship among members. This study intends to use them in the categories of human environment, physical environment, and reward system. First, human environment is a very important part of the job environment. The supervisor plays a role in forming an efficient working group and stimulating individual members of the group in charge to make the members achieve the maximum performance. The interaction between colleagues in the working group is more dynamic than the, than the incentive system or control of manager, and the adaptation to the working environment plays an important role. In addition, when members of the organization are satisfied 
with the the organization's job environment. They feel rewarding and contribute to the organization for themselves, and their job performance also increases. Second, Binner defined the physical environment as objective and physical factor that the company can control, and divided the component into facilities related elements and other elements. Park Yong Ki and Rao Chung Dok divided physical environment into work environment, maintenance of facilities, space for employees to rest and amenities, and employee welfare. Third, reward refers to the factors and that can include employees to continue to settle in the organization, which means all kinds of moni monetary benefits, non-financial benefits, and other benefits in return for his work and that employees maintain employment relationship with managers or operators. Second, concept and importance of the job satisfaction. Job satisfaction is a positive emotional state and that occurs through the evaluation of the job itself. The concept of job satisfaction in the early days was defined as an attitude derived from the emotional state obtained in relation to individual job activities. Then McCormick and Bifkin defined job satisfaction as positive emotional state that individuals experience according to their attitudes, values, beliefs, desires in relation to their job. As the studies of definitions and, and arguments put it, as a sense of satisfaction or achievement felt through job performance, which is closely related to the individual's need satisfaction, job satisfaction is a pleasant and good emotional state on their jobs. Job satisfaction is very important in that it enhances the emotional response and quality of life of employees. In addition, it's very important to have a high interest in job satisfaction of employees because customer satisfaction through service quality improvement, continuous relationship maintenance with customers, and management performance cannot be expected without satisfaction of employees who are the main agents of the service in service companies. In addition, job satisfaction is treated as very important in the field of organizational behavior because employees satisfied with their works can, incre uh, can create higher results than those who are not. And furthermore, it becomes an important standard for evaluating organizational management and operation. As for the personal aspect, to begin with, job satisfaction is important in value judgment of life, and job and workplace are important source of preparing resources uh, for human social life. Furthermore, the sense of accomplishment and pleasant feeling from the work can lead to rewarding life. In the end, one can get some charge of desire and awareness of quality of life. Second, Job satisfaction is an important factor in the aspect of human mental health. On the contrary, when dissatisfied with personal view and dimension of job satisfaction, it can act not only as an unstable factor in social life and other areas, but also as an element of dissatisfaction throughout life. Third, job satisfaction can affect physical health as well as mental health. As for the organizational aspects, first, positive attitude towards one's job can give a sense of stability in organizational life and positive factors and improve organizational productivity in workplace life, bond with employees and positive response to external society, resulting in an effect of promoting the organization and coherence of the organization. Second, when job satisfaction increases, the positive promotion effect of the organization can be increased by expressing the favorable feeling about the organization to the outside. Third, when employees perform their original duties in a positive way, the productivity of the organization will be maximized and negative factors such as turnover and 
absenteeism will be reduced. Third, job passion. Medieval philosophers regarded passion as an action of irrational sensory desires that employ pain and passivity. Individuals who are passionate about an activity are controlled by that passion and involve irrational thinking and behavior. From a Christian point of view, passion was seen and away from God. After the Middle Ages, Philosophers define reason as the higher part of the human mind, while passion is the action of sensation desire belonging to lower part of human mind. All kinds of inclinations accompanied by pleasure or pain, and emotional states which are the unique characteristics of irrational parts of human mind. Philosophical studies of the concept and value of passion in the late 20th century began to gradually affect the fields of philosophy, pedagogy, and business administration. In particular, psychologists defined passion as the goal of the highest priority with emotionally important results and emphasized the motivational aspect of passion. It means that people will spend a lot of time and effort to achieve their important goals. Valorant defined passion as a strong tendency towards favorite activities in which people devote time, devote energy, and place important values and asserted a dualistic approach. A dualistic approach is that passion activity is classified into harmonious passion and obsessive passion according to how to internalize the individual self and ident identity. In the previous studies on job satisfaction, Bicklow suggested that leaders with strong ethical commitment can influence autonomy. Therefore, autonomy is an important predictor of motiva motivation and passion. And the increase of control and autonomy through the sharing of power of ethical leadership is expected to have a positive relationship with harmonious passion rather than obsessive passion. Kao Dong Wook showed positive relationship between the boss ethical leadership and the subordinates' harmonious passion and organizational identification, but there was no correlation with the subordinates' job stress. And the ethical leadership of boss had a positive effect on the organizational identification of the subordinates and a negative effect on the job stress of the subordinates through the harmonious passion of the subordinates. Specifically, harmonious passion played a particle mediating role in the relationship between ethical leadership and organizational identification, and played a full mediating role in the relationship between ethical leadership and job stress. The implication of the results of previous studies on job passion is that employees with job passion will be satisfied and happy with their work which makes them immersed with attachment to their work. Furthermore, this passion will be conveyed in, re in the relationship with customers, and the satisfaction felt by customers will soon be transferred into their satisfaction. Happy employees with passion will deliver happiness to customers in interaction with customers, and the impressions experienced by customers will be circulated to satisfaction to employees again. Third part, research design. And to achieve the purpose of the study, a research model such as Figure 1 is presented based on the literature research and previous studies. In addition, the premise that the job environment will have a significant impact on accounting workers job satisfaction, and the proposition that job enthusiasm will play a moderating role in the relationship between job environment and job satisfaction. The hypothesis according to this is set up as follows and verified. Hypothesis 1, the job environment will have a significant effect on job satisfaction. First, the human environment of the job environment will have a significant effect on job satisfaction. Second, 
um, the physical environment of job environment will have a significant effect on job satisfaction. Third, the reward system of job environment will have a significant effect on job satisfaction. Hypothesis two, job passion will play a role of moderating the relationship between job environment and job satisfaction. The operational definition and measurement items for the variables used in this study are as follows. The job environment consisted of 15 items such as five items of human environment, human composition, communication, respect for personality, mutual trust, and non-communication. Five items of physical environment working or mutual uh, cooperation, maintenance of facilities, community facilities, and welfare facilities, and working environment. Five items of compensation system, salary level, fair promotion evaluation, promotion time, various allowance, and retirement system. The item measurement was evaluated by using a Likert five point scale with an average of one to five points. And the higher the average value the workers marks, the more satisfied they are in job environment sector. Job satisfaction was defined as personal satisfaction with their work and consists of six measurement items. Job achievement, growth and development opportunity, motivation for job, authority necessary for job performance, job satisfaction, and self-realization. The item measurement was evaluated by using the Likert five-point scale with an average of one to five points. And the higher the average value, the more satisfied the job environment factor. Job passion is defined as enthusiasm for the job that he has and consists of five measurement items. Proudness for accounting work, work experience, work value, raising his value, and harmony with other tasks. The item measurement was evaluated by using the Likert five points scale with an average of one to five points. And the higher the average value, the more satisfied the job environment factor. The next part, empirical analysis. First, validity and reliability. The KMO measurement of the research variables was 0.892. Butler's sphere for motion test value was 5,683.873. And the significance probability was 0.0000. .0000. And which turns out to be suitable for factor analysis by rejecting the null hypothesis as table 1 shows. The reliability criteria for Plumbax were 0.844 for human environment, 0.829 for physical environment, 0.843 for reward system, 0.890 for job satisfaction, and 0.77, and 0.877 for job enthusiasm which was higher than 0.7 and were eternally consistent. The factor analysis showed that all the scales used for mirroring variables have appropriate convergence and discriminant validity. Also, the reliability level of each variable was generally high, which was found to be appropriate for analysis in this study. And this is the table one. Second, correlation analysis. The results of correlation analysis between the main variables are presented in table two. The human environment, physical environment, and the composition system of job environment variables all showed a positive relationship, to, uh, relationship with job satisfaction as the result variable. Third, the effective relationship between job environment and job satisfaction. Multiple regression analysis was conducted to test the hypothesis one on the relationship between job environment and job satisfaction. The analysis result is the same as table three. The F value of the estimated regression analysis was 70.387 which was statistically significant at the significance level P. 
is less than 0 0.001 and the the r square was 0 0.401 which showed that the job environment such as human environment physical environment and reward system explained job satisfaction as 41 40.1 percent the value of dnw is 1.977 which is close to 2, it can be said to be independent. VIF of all independent variables put into the model is smaller than the standard value of 10, so it's judged that there is no problem with the multiple collinearity between independent variables. And this is table 3. The results of hypothesis 1 are as follows. First, the relationship between human environment and job satisfaction was found to have no statistically significant effect as the non-standardization coefficient of human environment on job satisfaction was 0 0.063. Therefore, hypothesis 1 and 1 was not supported. Second, the relationship between physical environment and job satisfaction was statistically significant and the significance level P is less than 0.001. With the non-standardization coefficient of physical environment for job satisfaction of 0.236 and therefore the physical environment had a significant positive effect on job satisfaction and hypothesis Hypothesis 1 and 2 was supported. Third, the relationship between the reward system and job satisfaction was statistically significant, and the significance level P is less than 0 0.001. With the non standardization coefficient of compensation system for job satisfaction being 0.499, therefore, the reward system had a significant positive effect on job satisfaction, and hypothesis 1 and 3 were supported. In summary, the physical environment and reward system of the job environment were found to increase accountants' job, job satisfaction. Therefore, companies should be interested in improving the interior, such as furniture, lighting, parlor, rest space in the office to improve the work efficiency. Also, it's necessary to maintain a fire and reasonable reward system. Next, the moderating effect of job passion. The result of verifying the moderating effect of job passion in the relationship between job environment and job satisfaction is explained as table 4. The result of analysis shows that the overall explanatory power is 40.1% and F is 70.387, which is statistically significant. In Model 2, job enthusiasm was put into the moderating variable. The explanatory power is 48.9%. And F is 77.430. The explanatory power increased by 8.8%, and the F value increased by 7.043% compared to Model 1. In the case of Model 3, the sub variables of job environment such as human environment, physical environment, and reward system were put into interaction with job enthusiasm. In Model, in model 3, the explanatory power was 49.9% and F is 46.385. Compared to Model 2, the explanatory power decreased by 1% and the F value decreased by 31.5%. 0.45 percent, but it but it turned out to be um, statistically significant. This is table four. 
when the results of hypothesis two was uh, were examined in detail, physical environment combined by job passion and reward system combined by job passion had statistically significant effects on job satisfaction, indicating that job passion had a moderating effect. However, the human environment combined by job passion was not statistically significant. So there was no moderating effect. Therefore, the physical environment had a reward system of job environment showed a moderating effect on the relationship between job satisfaction and job enthusiasm. And the last part, conclusion. This study aims to empirically investigate the relationship between accounting staff's job environment and their job satisfaction, and also aims to prove that there is the moderating effect of job enthusiasm. This is considered to have a great practical meaning in that it provides implication for the improvement and securing the job environment of the company and the enhancement of the efficiency of the company's work. The implications of the results of the empirical analysis are as follows. First, the physical environment and reward system in the job environment were found to increase accounting staff's job satisfaction. Therefore, companies should be interested in improving the interior such as furniture, lighting, color, and resting space in the office to improve the work efficiency of accounting staff. And it's necessary to maintain a fire and reasonable reward system for the compensation of accounting staff. Second, Job enthusiasm plays a very important role in the relationship between the staff's job environment and their job satisfaction. Therefore, companies should have continuous interest and investment in education or self-development that can inspire job enthusiasm, as well as job environment of accounting staff. This study attempted to approach job satisfaction and job enthusiasm, which are physical and psychological characteristics from an integrated perspective. The academic implication of this study is to prove that there is the relationship between the job environment and to clarify the importance of the job enthusiasm of a counter staff through empirical analysis. In addition, it has proven that companies should make continuous efforts to maintain a reasonable and fire reward system for the efforts to improve the physical environment for the job environment and the job and the work performance. That's all. Thank you.